a distant echo of the pre-Babel language. The Inklings believed in the existence of one proto-language, of which our modern language is but a shadow. C.S. Lewis delves into this literary and philosophical insight in his poem, The Birth of Language. In his, in his imagery, the sun symbolizes logos, the center of universal meaning, whose burning flings supernal things like spindrift from his stormy crown. The sun throws intelligible virtues down. Those virtues are the fiery, meaning-saturated words that come, as it were, fresh out of the mouth of God. At this point, words are still full of the creative powers of the sun, and the first suburb of the sun that they lave and beat upon is Mercury. As a god of language, Mercury changes those supernal and most concrete 